As you know, our company has announced a project competition for those people who use the free of charge uh, version of our Photomod package, Photomod Light, and uh, it is our commercial director, Alexander Chikurin, who will tell you about the results of this international contest. Hello, dear colleagues. Uh, it's a great pleasure to see so many people at the very on the very last day of the conference. And I have a very simple and pleasant mission in my presentation. That would be the official announcement of the results of the Photomod Light contest. I will tell you about the Photomod Light first. This is a free of charge version, which can be freely, after a simple registration, downloaded from our web page and used without any restrictions for testing, training, and doing some test projects. The number of photo mod light users is has been growing very fast. First two years, then this system appeared on torrents, where it can be uh, downloaded without any registration. Was much user. Now we are out of control of this torrent downloading. Anyway, we know that this system is used quite broadly. In the beginning of this year, we have announced, our company announced a contest uh, for Photomod Light projects. The main purpose of that contest was to provide opportunity for information and experience exchange to our Photomod Light users and also award them with something. Here you can see the prizes. First of all, I wanted to tell you that uh, we had two nominations. First is the education with Photomod Light and users Photomod Light for test projects. Uh, first prizes are quite serious. That would be a full Photomod uh, version for free. Here you can see the geography of the organizations who provided their projects. We have received a total of 11 different projects out of nine different countries from Russia, Latvia. We received two projects from these two countries. And um, gives me a special pleasure. Uh, yes, and we established commission so far made up of representatives of our company only. But maybe in future we'll invite some external experts. And it gives me a special pleasure to announce that prize first prize in the uh, educational application of Photomod Light goes to the Technical University of Athens, where they use Photomod, have used a Photomod Light for five years already, have used it quite extensively in three courses and also in some laboratory and practical classes. And throughout the education, they use both aerial and land imagery. Second prize also gives me special pleasure to announce it goes to the Lisbon University. The author of that project, Professor Paula Redwig, uh, Professor Paula Redwig made the presentation the first day, and uh, it's quite a serious and uh, extensive, exhaustive work. And finally. The third prize in this nomination goes to a number of companies. Uh, I'm sorry. No. That will be, again, second prizes, which go to the representative of Kazakhstan, Vladimir Smirnov, who was a private individual participating and to the Ural Federal University named after Yeltsin. Third prize goes to the National University of San Juan from Argentina and the Latvian University Faculty of Geography and Earth Sciences. We'll give additional rounds of applauses to them. To some, some of the nominees are here in this room with us, and we're going to give them the prizes soon after I announce all the results. In the second nomination, which would be Format Light for test projects, 
Uh, first prize goes to the Spanish representative Francisco Bascon Arroyo for the city of Badajoz at years 1945-1956. Unfortunately, he couldn't attend our conference, but I hope that uh, it will be pleasant for him. Anyway, second prize goes to the Belarusian project for the digital train model creation on the base of a based on the spectral system. And the third prize goes to Irina Karakoleva from Bulgaria. And again, representatives from Latvia, Latvian Geospatial Information Agency, and to the Siberian State Geodesy Academy from Russia. All these projects are going to be published and posted on our web page, which will serve to greater expansion of photomod light among community, both educational and test project implementing community. And now, as long as we have some of the laureates and uh, uh, nominees here in this room, I would like to in invite Mr. Adrov so that he would personally give away the prizes to the heroes. Unfortunately, Professor Andreas Georgopoulos couldn't uh, attend this conference, but here we have our partner from Greece, Yanis Anidis, and we invite him to the stage to award him the prize. Actually, I hope that Andreas Georgopoulos uh, is watching this online broadcast. I would like to use this opportunity to send him best regards and the words of thanks for this uh, great piece of work that he did. The second prize, in, in the, again, in the education nomination, goes to the Lisbon University. And it has been a special pleasure to invite Professor Paolo Redveig to the, uh, to the stage. And finally, here we have yet another award winner who receive, will receive prizes in two nominations in education and uh, test project nominations. That would be Petris Peterson Again, I would like to thank everybody who participated in this competition. Hopefully next year we'll have more uh, projects to select from and we'll see more award winners at the next conference. Thank you.